Hello everyone, this is John Jenkins and uh, this Kickstarter is called Draw Box and this is the lock that I've been drawing for about a year now. Um, what is Draw Locks it is the ultimate guide to learning how to draw, and this is this is the one exercise that could really uh, put you over the hump. As in, uh, it could really improve your drawing to the point where you can become a true artist. And why locks? Well, take a, take a look at the lock for a second. You notice that a, a, lock, a lock contains every shape that you will ever need to learn how to draw in order to become an artist. You can see right there is the, the circle and it has a uh, uh, convex uh, shape right here, convex, shape like a, like a teardrop shape, and then you have right, right here, right here is the, uh, the curve, and, uh, you can see it, it's got like a, uh, a, a, a box shape, and, and, uh, and a, a, a cylinder shape right here. Right here is like a cylinder shape coming up here. And it's got like a, almost like a, if you, you, you can see it's got like a cone shape. If you, if you uh, connect these two areas right here like that, it's got a cone shape. It's got, uh, uh, it's, it's spherical as well because it has the, the convex shape right here and the, the bigger uh, 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 cylindrical area right here. So those together add sort of like a spherical shape. And obviously it's got the, uh, uh, the rectangular prism shape, you know, going out this way. So basically, uh, locks, locks contain every shape that you will ever need to learn how to draw. In order to become an artist, and why did I start drawing locks? Well, I started. I, I I wanted to become an artist my whole life, but I could never make myself draw. You know, it took me years to finish one sketchbook. You know, and it was so hard to. It was so difficult to. What? Every once in a while, I would draw a great character, but it would be physically impossible for me to draw the same character from a different angle or create like a series uh, with that character. I used to be, I used to be an, an amateur manga artist, and like once once I once I would draw that first character, I would be married to it. I wouldn't be able to. I would I, I would be so afraid that I could not. Uh, live up to the original drawing that I wouldn't even be able to draw it from a different angle, and uh, and uh, you know uh, drawing from anatomy reference was difficult because those shapes were so complex and I didn't I didn't have the basics down yet so um, I could not. Uh, make things appear uh, uh, realistic. I could not give that good uh, appearance to it. And um, so I got, I, I, I started to get desperate and I started, you know, once I had enough, once I had enough willpower built up and I was really ready to draw, I just started drawing random house items. I, I was drawing shoes, garbage cans, uh, detergent, detergent bottles, things of that nature. 
but the only thing that could stick with me was this. Why? Because, like I said, it, it contains every shape you'll ever have to learn how to draw. And on top of that, it's simple, it's small, and, you know, you can pose it. I always pose it like this at this angle. You can, you can pose it at the same angle every time. Um, it's shiny, so you can. I, this helps me study uh, drawing shadows and highlights as well. Um, so there's there's so many benefits. Contains all the shapes. Uh, simple. Easy, yet sophisticated. Practice your. Uh, Highlights and shadows, practice materials, practice reflections. This is this is very reflective, so I can I can draw other images on top of this that that are the reflections of, of what is on the other side of the room. And um, so basically, I want to start a movement, a jaw locks movement, and uh, everybody you know everybody gets your locks. And we can, you know, uh, 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 go with that. And uh, um, I'm writing a book. I have a sketch. I, I have a. I have a. I have a bunch of images of all the locks that I've drawn over the past year and a half. Actually, I started in 2015, so it's been two years. Uh, so I have. I have all the locks that I've drawn. For the past two years, I want to put them all in the book, and I want to show you step by step uh, the evolution. How, how did my locks look when I first started? How do they look now? Um, I want to teach people how how to think like an artist, you know, uh, and uh, hope. Hopefully, um, this will this will lead to greater uh, greater awareness about uh, the the subject of art. Maybe I, I can encourage more people to get back to drawing if they if they wanted to uh, become uh, be be more proficient at art. And uh, hopefully this this will lead to me having a lifelong affinity for drawing, and this will lead to me, you know, being able to finally produce at the level that I at the level that I would like to produce. And that's it. So uh, I have some tears. You know, my goal uh, my goal is fifty thousand dollars. And, um, yeah, I, I'm going back to the high goals, uh, uh, you know, having a lower goal of $500 for the last Kickstarter, that was wise for its time, but, uh, now I have to get back to thinking big, and this is how I'm going to do it. So, uh, and I, I've gone back to doing my own graphic design, which is also, uh, uh, a good thing. I tend to get more views when I do my own graphic design. When I, when I give the graphic design to somebody else, I, I tend to get less views. Uh, so I want to continue on with that. And a lot of great kids starts coming up. I'm coming up with new ideas every day. So uh, have a nice day, and I hope you uh, donate to my campaign. Uh, see you later. Bye.